Well, still ringing. He's home. How'd he sound? Call me. Nice. I know this is a stupid question, but why can't you just talk to him? Because yesterday he called to say that they were still looking for a rehearsal space and uh, that he'd call when he had more news. So now I have to wait until he calls about the band. And in between, I call and hang up on him. Pathetic. Not so pathetic. I used to hang up on Dean all the time. You did? I remember that. When did you hang up on me? Right when we first met. You should have just said something. I couldn't do that. Why not? Because then you would have known that I was calling and therefore that I liked you. Yes, but I liked you too. Well, I know that now. You could have known that then. Dean, please, this is a girl thing. Uh, okay, tell me when I'm supposed to pay attention again. I'm gonna love him forever, and he's never gonna know it. What if you coughed? Dean. Sorry. At least he's at home and not out with a girl. Very true. He could be home with a girl. Dean. Sitting here, staring at my pizza. You think he was at home with a girl? No, no, I don't. I'm gonna call again. Good idea, and pay attention to the background noise this time. Oh, cool, pizza. Shh. She's calling Dave to see if she can hear a girl in the background. Oh, I voted that she actually say something. You're a boy, you know nothing about this. Well, what'd you hear? Quadrophenia? Mm. Classy, but not date-like. You think? Definitely. What if he met a girl who's a major Who fan? What? Why are you causing trouble? Or right, can I talk to you in the kitchen? Oh, sure. Be good. Go ahead.